In this video, I show you how to convert an HGIC file to a JPEG on your iPhone. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. And let's jump straight into this guide. The first thing you need to do in order to go and convert HEIC files to JPEG is to go and open up your photos. Then once you're in your photos, what you need to do is go and select the photos which you want to go and convert. So in this case, I know this image here is definitely um, an HEIC image. So I'm gonna go and select this one here and this one here. Screenshots don't tend to be HEIC images. It's only images you've taken with your actual camera. Then once you've done that, you then need to go and tap on the three dots in the bottom right of photos like so. And um, what we need to do is go and press on copy, which is the current the last option and maybe slightly different fee, but it should be similar to so go and tap on copy. Now, what you need to do is close off the photos app like so, and you need to go and open up the files app. Now the files app should be by default common on your iPhone. Um, so what you need to do is swipe across and go and look for it. In my case, it's on the second page here. If you're struggling to find it, you can always go to your app library and go and search for it. Um, and you can also go and drag down on your iPhone to find it as well. Then go and open up the files app and what you need to do is go and tap on browse and go and tap it maybe once or twice to make sure you're on this page here called browse. And then you can go into these different locations and what you need to do is tap on on my iPhone like so. Then what you need to do is go to the top right and go press those three dots because you want to go and create a new folder for this. Otherwise it just makes your phone quite a mess. So go and tap on new folder like so. And we're gonna go and name this convert like this. You can name it anything that it doesn't matter. Then once you've made the folder, go and tap on it like so. And then what you need to do is just hold your finger anywhere in this folder like so. And after a few seconds, you're gonna get this list of options. And what we need to do is now go and paste the photos we just copied. So press paste just like that. And as you can see, we've now pasted these images in and these are now JPEGs. And you're probably wondering, how do you know that? But well, if you go and hold your finger on it and press get info, then as you can see, it now says kind JPEG image. And for this one here, it's also going to go and say JPEG image. Basically, it automatically goes and converts it when you go and paste them um, out of the Photos app. And then if you want to go and get these back to your photos because you want to go and send them and things like that, and then you may want to go and get these images back into your photos library, or you may want to go and send them to people. So to do that, then what you want to do is tap on the three dots in the top right of the folder, and then press select, go and select all the photos or the photos that you want to go and send or add back to your photos app. Then go and tap on the share icon in the bottom left, this square with the arrow going out of it. And then what you can do is choose somebody to go and send the images to or press save to images and they'll be added back to your camera roll. So I just went and saved the images and as you can see they're back in my camera roll and if you then go and press on the info button in the bottom or go and drag down like so as you can see it now says JPEG just there. If you guys found this useful please go down below and leave me a like. Peace.